Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Finally the wait is over. The United States Congress has approved the Joe Biden's administration's decision to proceed with GE jet engine deal with India. This development paves the way for implementation of agreement between GE Aerospace and HL which includes not only the manufacturing of jet engines in India but also an unprecedented level of technology transfer and licensing agreements. The approval process was initiated prior to Prime Minister Narendra Modi's visit to US. The US Department has notified the House and Senate Foreign Relations Committee about the sale on July 28, 2023. As no objection were raised during the 30-day period following notification, the deal is now free to proceed. The Memorandum of Understanding between G and HL was signed on June 22, 2023 in Washington during the PM Narendra Modi's three-day visit to the US. The no objection paves the way for implementation of G's agreement with HL on F414 engines including manufacturing and technology transfer. This will be followed by submitting quotes by G and price negotiation will commence post which the final deal could be inked. When the contract was initially negotiated way back in 2012, US has agreed for 58% of transfer of technology, which has been now increased to 80%. As a part of deal, 99 engines will be manufactured in India. The Indian Air Force has projected demand of nearly 120 LCA Mark II aircrafts, which will further increase the size of the order for GF414 engines. As per report, the following aspects of G engines will be produced in India and HL which includes a special coating for erosion and corrosion, repair technology for turbine, compression disc and blades, coating and machining of single crystal turbine blades, machining and coating of hotened parts, complete tech transfer for blisk machining, machining of powder metallurgy, polymer matrix composition, laser drilling for combustion, bottle boring of shafts. The collaboration of jet engine production will begin soon as the deal between GE and HL is signed. It is likely that technology transfer will take place in phases with 80% of the value added to the engine occurring in India within three years. While US has agreed for machining and coating of single crystal turbine blades, what is not offered is the casting process of the single crystal blade. DMRL has already developed the vacuum investment casting process to produce state-of-art directionally solidified and single crystal blades and veins for aero gas turbine engines. The single crystal turbine blades and veins are produced by using orthogonal grain selector from advanced nickel-based superalloys. India must push US for production of single crystal blade using DMRL's technology in India and get it certified by GE. This is the one of the major challenge or roadblock with India's indigenous engine development. However, the deal is definitely going to be a remarkable step for developing the industrial ecosystem for aero engine. India should now focus on development of technologies that are not being transferred as a part of this deal. India must plan ahead for development of more powerful engine that could power AMC Mark II fighter jet in future. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.